Good morning everyone. How are you? I hope you are fine. Today our lesson will be about the digestive system. We will continue learning about systems in our human body which is very interesting and today will be about the digestive system. I am teacher Mirna al -Karout. This is grade 3 and we are teaching subject science. Are you ready? Let's start! First of all, I want to ask you, why do we eat? Do you know why do we eat? We actually eat to fuel our body with energy. Do you know what is energy? This is energy. We need energy to stay focused and awake and we get it from where? From our food. So in order to have this energy from food, do you know what do we need to do? What do we need to do with this food? We need to break it down. Yes, we need to break it down like this but into smaller and the smaller particles so we can use it in our body. Do you want to know how? That's why we have the digestive system. Do you know what is the digestive system? This is it. We call it what? We call it the digestive system. It's here where we break down food and absorb it to get energy. See, it's in our body. Let's try to discover our digestive system. Look at this very beautiful picture. This is an example of how our digestive system works. So it works like a factory. Look here, it is as if it is a factory, right? First of all, our food enters our body and then it comes across our teeth and it breaks it down, right? And with the help of our tongue, it breaks it down and we swallow it. After that, this is our food the tube, we swallow it through the food the tube and then it goes into the stomach. The stomach completes the breaking down of this food with the help of these guys. And then what happens? Then we go all the way to absorb the food in our body and of course we will have some wastes just like the factory so we always have some wastes do you remember that in the factories uh, there used to be a lot of wastes same here in our digestive system we have some wastes and we flush them down the toilet through our intestine and in the end of our intestine let's see them one by one let's see these organs one by one First of all, we start eating using our mouth and our teeth in the mouth and our tongue. Let's see what happens next. When, it, when the food enters the mouth, it then goes into this tube. Do you know what do we call this tube? We call it the food tube. This food tube actually delivers the food into where it delivers the food into the stomach. What do we call this? We call it stomach. What happens in the stomach? In the stomach, we break down the food. We break it down here in the stomach. What happens next? What do we have after the stomach? We have the intestines. What do we call them? 
the intestines these are small intestines and these are large intestines what happens in the intestines in the intestines we absorb the food we absorb the food that we need so our body can get its energy what happens next in the end we will have some wastes as we said like the factory so how can we get rid of these wastes through the anus through what through the anus so we get rid of the wastes through the anus this is our digestive system can you repeat it after me what is the first organ the mouth and then we have the food tube the stomach the intestines and finally the anus this is our digestive system what did we learn about the digestive system we learned that the digestive system allows us to break down the food we eat and absorb it so that we can use it in our body this is our lesson for today my dear students i hope you enjoyed it study well and good luck goodbye everyone